My name is Steve Sabella, and I am from Jerusalem, Palestine, currently based in Berlin. 38 Days of Recollection is a project that started in 2009 when I lived in a Palestinian home in Jerusalem that had been occupied by Israelis since 1948. No one knows who the original owners are. They live in exile somewhere else. Even though I lived for 30 years in Jerusalem, my city of birth, I was constantly living in a state of alienation, a mental exile. I lived in this house for 38 days, but felt unsettled and tried to make sense of the history by photographing every detail of the house. I photographed the house in Jerusalem with my digital camera. I took colored images and had them converted into black and white negatives. I then collected fragments of paint from old city walls in Jerusalem, including the house I was born in. I painted light-sensitive black and white photo emulsion on the fragments, printed the negative on the light-sensitive fragment, and used chemistry to fix the image in place. The colors of the paint emerged to the surface of the photograph, transforming it again into a color image. The experiment was like seeing a digital image transform into one-time original, a unique work of art. This work explores the relationship between two realities, one being Israeli colonization and the other being the Palestinian right of return. This is the story that emerges on the surface of the work, but the visual palimpsest that unfolds explores not just the history of the house, but more profoundly, the history of the image itself. When I saw the result, I believed I had cracked a visual code. It turned out to be a visual dilemma. I traveled to London to show it to the British Museum, and just as I was exiting the underground tube station, one of the boxes which contained the artwork I cherished the most slipped from my hand and shattered into pieces. Now this artwork no longer exists, but digital images of it do. They are the only proof that I have of creating it. It turns out that 38 Days of Recollection was an exploration of the genealogy of the image. Archaeologists aim to find ancient fragments that would add to our understanding of history. For example, we often read cave paintings in terms of how they decode the life structure of the past. But what is their essence? How do they fit into the larger visual puzzle? How do they function in the process of tracing and solving the history of the image? By examining exile from different angles and perspectives, I was able to dig deeper into the relationships between images and discover new levels of consciousness. Through that process, I lived in a new reality that I had revealed to myself. Like a visual investigator, I looked at images directly, observed their characteristics, the connections between them, and their origin. Rather than comparing images to reality, I looked into the reality they create. By positioning images, like an individual puzzle, I put them together piece by piece to ask the question of what exists first, the image or the world.